Okay, Shanti, I was wondering for a guided meditation, how to find comfort in yourself. Yes. Just sit comfortably or lie down comfortably. Free your body from all the tensions. If necessary, shake out your arms and legs, loosen up the neck. Do the palming if necessary. We are nothing but non bundle of nerves. Through the nerves, prana flows. So we allow the prana to flow freely. Body is only the framework. Body is a dead matter. We are nerves and prana is flowing. So feel your being as nothing but flow of prana. Prana flows throughout the body. Prana doesn't distinguish between skin, bones, muscles, vital organs, nerves, mind, emotion, prana exist at all the levels, at our gross level, astral level and causal level. If you release the barriers, if you release the ego, if you dissolve the boundaries, prana will flow and harmonize your total being. That means your gross body, astral body and causal body will be harmonized. Energy will flow from consciousness into supreme consciousness into causal body which is consciousness into astral body which is mind and emotions gross body which is physical body with sense organs and then you feel total. Also you feel harmony within and without. Prana which is within us is also surround us. So we want to dissolve all the separation. Breath is prana. To control the mind, we control prana. And to control prana, you control breath. Control breath doesn't mean by force but observing the breath. Keep the eyes closed. Allow the breath to flow naturally. It flows in and it flows out. Try not to control, not to push. Just flow along. When breath goes in, let your consciousness go in. Breath goes out, consciousness goes out. Breath goes in to the real source, which is Atman, deep within the heart. Atman is the spark of Supreme Consciousness. So Supreme Consciousness, which is macrocosm, reflects within heart as microcosm. Go inward, everything dissolves, you become nothingness, shunya or zero. And zero is the foundation of everything. Emptiness allows to fill up. But when already we are filled, the Supreme cannot enter. So go inward, feel total emptiness. Freedom from all the burdens is emptiness. When breath flows out, flow out in all the directions, beyond the boundaries of the body, in the space, until your mind dissolves, until you feel totally connected and harmonious with total existence. That is also other part of our being, that I am everything, 
there is nothing but me. Everything is extension of my being. Continue with that awareness. Go deep into your real basic nature and expand into infinity. That would remove intermediate world which is nothing but illusion. Intermediate world is created by the mind. In the process mind dissolves. All the projection of mind in the past and future also dissolves. When mind dissolves, you become only consciousness, which is nothing but perfect. Its nature is immortality, consciousness and bliss. So that is where we find comfort. You don't find comfort by getting the pleasure of the senses, pleasures of the world, pleasures by extending the mind in the future, pleasure by memories of the past, pleasure of being with activities and people. These are only temporary comfort. Total comfort comes by being quiet, being alone with ourselves. Just be alone and let that feeling of peace grow within the heart. Feel that shining flame within the heart, a radiant flame and let it expand. Feel up the chest cavity, entire trunk. Let it extend through the arms, legs, throat, neck, face. Extend beyond the boundaries of the body. Extend to everything and everyone until you become homogeneous. This is the true comfort. True comfort is not something we seek. It is our essential nature. To experience it, we have to be quiet. We don't have to attain it by doing any practice, doing anything. Anything we do is only covers up with more boundaries and more burdens. Just let go of all the boundaries, all the burdens, and be at peace. And as you stay in that state, you will awaken the inner spark. You will awaken intuition. You will awaken the wisdom. You will get the spark of direct perception. You gain the direct clarity that you don't need to get approval of anyone, any book or religion. It is self-approved thing. It is the knowledge of self. Do we need to know who am I? Even you are in the dark, you are lost in the jungles, you are lost somewhere else. Do you question, I am? It is already there. I am is already known. Though we don't know where we are, but I am is always there. So that self-knowledge and comfort is our basic nature. We forget about it. And we have to remind ourselves. Repeat this every day. Listen to it every day. And then extend it after you get to that 
stay quiet and spend more and more time because as you spend more time you build up those impressions or sanskaras it becomes part of you and those sanskaras control your life so by constant repetition it would grow also during the day apply it even while your eyes are open you are doing activities you are talking to others remember that i am only an observer i am not involved i am not touched by turmoil of the world and though you are in the middle of activities you can experience stillness and aloneness of the self